Good morning, this is Tom Littley from Velo Spark. I'm about to show you around the Hemiway Zebra. This is the Hemiway Zebra. It's a fat bike, cargo bike. The one that you can see in front of you is the step through design to make getting onto the bike easier. You've got standard on the back, a rear rack. The whole bike can carry 400 pounds that's including the rider weight it's suitable for riders between five foot three and six foot three some of the standard features i'll talk you through now you've got the fat tires which are 26 inch by four inch in width very very nice thick tread got disc brakes these are hydraulic as well and your reservoir there to keep topped up is just here they're tectro brakes so a good spec brake you've got a hydraulic fork with lockout adjustment the lockout adjustment is for when you're riding on terrain, which we're out in the Licky Hills today. You will have the hydraulic uh, fork set, so it's offering some uh, shock absorption. But if you're riding on the flat and you need to be putting some effort in, you don't want the front of the bike bobbing up and down. On the other side, you've got a preload adjustment which allows for you to control the amount of uh, damping. This is all explained in the user manual and how to set these settings yourself. The disc brakes are 160 millimeters in diameter. So just coming up to the cockpit, I know that sounds ridiculous calling it the car. So on the handlebars, you've got the controls for the motor control. You've got the power on button, which you just need to press and hold. And then on the display, the unit is powered up. You've got a simple up and down. So you've got the plus and the minus. So if I press the plus here, I've gone up to level two, level three, level four, level five. The display also shows the battery level indicator to how much battery life is remaining. Uh, the trip computer is here as well, showing how many miles it's done and obviously the speed. Also got control for the lights. So if I press that on now, and we go round to the lights, you've got your lights on there and on the rear. Okay, and the Himiway low go right in the middle of the light there. Um, another reflector at the back as well. So I can turn the lights back off. You've also got this uh, or information button there that just scrolls through the various menus within the trip computer. Also on the a standard, you get a bell. I'm gonna say that's a little bit pathetic, but uh, it's a key safety feature, obviously, to let people know that you're coming up behind them. Along here you've got the controls for the rear cassette. It's a seven speed Shimano drivetrain. And you've also got a twist throttle. And you just saw the bike spring into life there. Now 
the twist throttle here in the UK is restricted to four kilometers per, ha per hour, which is the maximum you can allow on a, a twist throttle. But this allows you just to get the bike moving before you can start pedaling and get that cadence back up again. We shift round here a little bit. Just underneath here, you've got the battery here. Now this is a 960 watt hour battery, 20 amp hours, which will allow the bike to, to obviously depending on user weight. So if you're a big chuffer like me at 220 pounds, you're probably looking at near 50, 60 miles. If you're light and sprightly at 75 kilos, you're probably looking at nearer 80 miles on the lowest assist, which is power assist one. So using the motor just bearingly. A nice comfy saddle here. That's adjustable by the quick release here for height. Got a standard stand as well, kickstand. So your motor is just in there. Now this motor is 200, restricted to 250 watts, but it is actually a 750 watt motor, but restricted for here in the UK, which is a legal requirement before it's actually classed as a moped. So you get this nice standard rack uh, with this lovely piece of wood that's uh, embossed with the Hemiway logo. What you will notice with this bike is the quality of it. If I just take you in there to the welds, just all around the, uh, the frame, this has not been skimped on at all. Mention the the all important CE logo to show that it's uh, safe and certified for use in the UK. You've got various mounting points, uh, one for a bottle cage here. And you've also got these on the side here, which is for a front mounted basket. So it really is a bike that's designed for use as a commuter. As a delivery bike, just an everyday bike to get you out of the car, getting into the fresh air, and just getting a bit of freedom, making life easier on yourself rather than parking a car up. So the different colours, and I will put these up on the screen. Now, as this is my first vlog, I ain't got a clue how to do that, but I'm sure I'll work out how to do it. But this is, as I say, a deep uh, orange, which is more closer to yellow. Um, but we do white, we do green, blue, and I do believe there's a grey one in the step-through design. So as I said, this is the step-through design. But we, the Hemiway also do a step over, which where the bar will come across here. And again, I'll put one of these up on the screen. And they've got um, a few different colours. There's uh, Skyline Blue, which again is a nice looking bike. Uh, Grey. And there's, uh, I think there's the blue as well. Um, but I will confirm this um, when I put the, the various models up on the screen. So if there's any questions, obviously put them in the comments and I'll come back to you. And if you can give us a like and subscribe, that'd be fantastic. But thank you for listening. And my first vlog over and out.